get started, let me just tell you something a little bit about myself. Guys, I am not much of a cook at all. I try, but truth be told, I'm really not that good. I do know this, when it comes to making spaghetti, the way that you test to see if the noodles are ready is you throw them at the wall and see if they stick. Some are gonna stick, some aren't gonna stick. It just takes trial and error of doing it over and over and over to start to figure out exactly what to do to make them perfect every time. So today we're gonna to talk about Instagram stories and the insight information that you can gain from the story. And that's gonna be a lot like cooking spaghetti noodles. Every time we put something out there on an Instagram story, aren't we really just throwing stuff out there just hoping it sticks? Well, the insights are gonna tell us the stickiness factor of our stories. Let's get a nice big sip of coffee in and get ready to dive into understanding your Instagram stories insights so you can figure out what's sticky and what's not. Here we go. So here we are ready to look at your insights on your stories to see how well they're performing. Now this will only be available on business accounts, so you wanna be sure you have your Instagram set as a business account. Now, when you are on your Instagram page, you'll see right up here is your profile picture. There's two places where you can find story information. So for current story information, if you'll tap on your story and you see your story pop up, just swipe up, there you go, just swipe up and you'll see your most recent stories that are here for 24 hours. Now, what you're going to see below that is this little uh, icon over here to the left. It looks like a series of buildings in blue. You wanna be sure that that is the area that you're looking at, not one of these others. So if you go down, this is where you'll find some information specific to whichever one of these stories uh, this is pointing at. So if I tap on, let's say my 36, you'll see the numbers change. And it will tell you that so far in this 24 hour period, 36 accounts have been reached with this story. It's been uh, viewed 43 times. No one has followed the account from this story, so chances are they were already following the account, so it's no new followers. And then as far as navigation goes, it will give you some information here that tells you how many people uh, went back an image, how many went forward an image, went on to the next story, and, uh, let me scroll that up there and then how many exited Instagram after viewing that one particular story. So this, uh, if you just tap through the different pictures at the top, this again will tell you the detail information um, on each of these stories. You'll notice here on 31, where I had a count of 31, it says one action taken and that's where people reply to your story and you get a DM from that. So. Uh, that's really what you're always trying to achieve is trying to get some sort of engagement or, or interaction going. Now, let's look at insights from a longer period of time. Okay, from a longer period of time, we're gonna tap on these three bars right up here at the top, on the top right from our main screen. And you'll see where it says insights, second one down. And again, these are on business accounts. Now we're only focusing on stories for right now. So if I scroll down a bit, you'll see where it has stories. And of course, these are the same, the same view of the last 24 hours. But if I tap on see all, it will show me all of my stories from the past 14 days. So here's where I'm going to start getting some real solid uh, stickiness to figure out what's really working and what's not working. So initially, I can go through and see how many views each of these stories had, okay? And just like with the others, you wanna find some maybe detailed information. So look, here's all these stories. So let me tap on one of these and it will pull up the story and I can swipe up just like I did before and now I get the detail of that particular story. Everything again is accessible either 24 hours through here or 14 days from the three bars or the little sandwich up there. So guys, I hope that tip was helpful for you today and I can't wait to see what you've learned and how you might change things a little differently based on the inside information for your Instagram Stories account. Until next time, cheers.